Good evening. It is Sunday. I don't know why I had to think about that. I know it's Sunday the 9th of June. It's about half 11 at night. Um, I've had a lovely relaxing day. It'd be nice to just sit and not do a lot. You know, I've done the washing up and I've put some laundry in. I need to hang up. I must do that before I go upstairs. Um, and I've watered all my houseplants. Other than that, I have been resting and I've been crocheting. And that's it. That has been lovely. I have done a bit of work on the amigurumi that I'm making for Ned, the one I'm designing from scratch for the first time ever. Um, which is an amigurumi version of the Pokemon Salazzle. He says Salazile, but it's spelt Salazzle. I don't know. It's not one I'm at all familiar with. Here's her head. I have been reliably informed that they are only ever female, so it's definitely a she. <laughs> it is, Neris. <clears throat> um, yeah, he's been not pestered me about this but he has been asking every couple of days whether I've done any work on it yet oh, maybe she's soaking uh, so I thought today I had no other concrete plans so I'd do a bit of work literally you know sat next to him on the sofa so that he could see how long it was taking me um not because you know I want him to back off so much because it's important to him and I want to make it for him but I do just want him to appreciate the fact that this isn't like a beanie hat that I can whip up in, e in an evening <laughs> you know this is a labour of love and you know it's a design project as well as the crochet itself um I've not been timing it so I don't know exactly but I reckon it's taken me over two hours to do you know that much um, I had to rip back all of that at one point because the way I was doing it before just was not at all right. Hello, Neris. Um, I'm still not entirely happy with it, but it's okay. It's, you know, it's approximately the right shape. And I'm sure once I've you know, finished it enough to put like facial features and that on it, it'll look, I'll be a lot happier. And the important thing is that Ned's happy with it and he's seen that. And it's like, yeah, that looks like the right thing. So, so that's good. The other thing I have done, if Neris will let me show you, without getting it wet, she's been out in the rain. I'm going to sneeze, possibly. No, I'll try not to. Because I have finished another panel of the midwife mile a minute blanket that I'm testing the pattern for and joined it onto the others. That's five panels now. If I was just doing the, um, if I was making it the size that the pattern is written for, I would only have one more strip to go. <clears throat> but in this yarn, excuse me, <coughs> sorry, in this yarn that would be a very small blanket, especially because the panels would be shorter as well they'd only be that length i can't get it all in shot you know, they'd be eight repeats instead of 12 and you can already see you know that's the width of it it's not wide um but emma is always very happy for us to do as long as we are following the instructions in the pattern in terms of like how the stitches are worked and um that sort of thing she doesn't matter what kind of yarn we use she doesn't matter if we do you know a bigger version anything like that and i am so in love with this yarn that i want to use it all up and make a big blanket <laughs> so this is going to be the short edge it's you know it's still not massive but it's it's a decent width it's you know, maybe Maybe half my width again, but my shoulders 
ish which is nice and it'll be nice and long well I don't know I might make it sort of squarish we'll see how much yarn I've got left I don't know but I'm absolutely loving how the colours are coming together in this um, and I'm really really glad that I chose this black sparkly yarn to join it to join the panels um, and I'll be doing the border with that as well because I think it just it really makes the colours pop to use a fairly common tone of phrase <laughs> these days so yeah really really happy with how that's working out and it's um, not a mindless pattern you do have to keep count but because it, because each strip is very narrow it's only hang on 13 it's 18 stitches wide and then the repeat is two three four five no one two three four six where you repeat and once you've got that locked in the um the panels work up really really fast um relatively speaking <laughs> um, and it takes me you know, going when they're quite long panels it's taking me under an hour and a half per panel and then joining one panel to the next takes about half an hour so under two hours for each bit which okay sounds like a lot if you're not a crocheter but if you are you will know that's not long really not for um not for something of this size um yeah so it's working out nicely i'm going to try and keep up with that because the test due date i've got a little while but it is looming <laughs> um i've got other things i need to do as well but that's okay all going well ned will be back at school tomorrow bloody best um, he has seemed absolutely fine this weekend. Um, uh, yeah, he said his throat was a little bit sore again this evening, but he, it hasn't been anything like as bad. He's not had a fever for at least 24 hours. Um, you know, that we've noticed he hasn't felt too hot at any point at all. We haven't even taken his temperature because we haven't felt the need. Uh, he hasn't needed any medicine. So we are as confident as we can be. So I'm just tidying up this project back while I'm talking to you. Confident as we can be that he has recovered at least sufficiently to go to school, which will make his friends very happy. <laughs> As a couple of them have um, I've had a couple of messages saying that people are missing him, which is lovely. Um. So yeah, that's it. I'll start rambling. Um, I don't have any exciting plans for tomorrow other than keeping on keeping on various bits of admin and housework and crochet so I will come I'm never going to promise anymore because you know what I'm like I will try and make sure I come back tomorrow to tell you what I've got up to all right bye for now <laughs>